Hey, how goes it? I'm here with Elias. How goes it, bro, bro? Hey, what's up? So, why don't you introduce yourself to my audience, let them know who you are and what you do, and then we'll get into this awesome book that you've got. Sure, sure. So, I'm Elias Ahonen, as you mentioned, and uh, I'm here in Calgary at the Crypto Convention. I do a few things in blockchain. I run Token Valley, um, do some consulting stuff, but really I'm known for writing uh, the encyclopedia of physical bitcoins and cryptocurrencies. So, let's take a look at this real quick. This is the encyclopedia of physical cryptocurrencies. You mind telling us a little bit about some of the actual physical cryptocurrencies that you may have in this class case? Sure, sure. So basically, um, these physical bitcoins they were made as uh, gimmicks originally, just to um, to show people that you know Bitcoin is digital, but you can transfer it easily. These ones here um, are well known. They're called Casatius coins, and they actually contain one Bitcoin each. So one whole Bitcoin. That's right. So you can actually take the coin, and there's a little sticker there. And if you peel that sticker, there's a QR code essentially uh, where you can access that Bitcoin. So it was made as a educational tool. Well, here's one Bitcoin. I give it to you. You control it. I don't control it anymore. And now they're very collectible. So what are up with some of these meme-looking coins you may have over here? So um, a lot of these coins are made as uh, as gimmicks or as uh, pieces of art to um, to commemorate different things about the blockchain. Uh, this one here is. Uh, is a Doge coin. It's just Much, whoa. one one ounce of silver, nothing in there. Whereas this one actually has ten thousand Doge coins inside. So, what does something like this run? It really depends. Um, some of these are very rare; only twenty-five or a hundred made. So, it's very hard to value. Um, most of these are worth well upwards of a thousand or even five. You know, depending on the coin. So, where can people go to find more information and get a hold of your book? So I have, a, I have a website just recently launched actually, it's called CryptoNumist.com. Numismatics being the uh, study of coins and crypto being, well, you know what that is. So <laughs> that's CryptoNumist.com. You can buy the book there and there's some information about the uh, more sought after coins. Thank you, bro, bro. Appreciate the tour and have a day. My pleasure.